Joe Wicks has candidly shared that he and his wife can go a day or two without talking. Joe Wicks, 36, otherwise known as the body coach, has admitted that he doesn't speak with his wife, Rosie Jones, 31, for a day or two at times. Rosie is a former model who started her career as a teenager. The fitness trainer spoke about times they have bickered during their relationship in a new interview. Joe was asked if the couple have disagreements. But he revealed that they don't have rows and tend to give the silent treatment if they are annoyed with one another. The coach admitted they both have stubborn tendencies. When asked if they argue, he said, we don't really. The 36-year-old said, we're more likely to give the silent treatment if we annoy each other. We can be stubborn and can go a day or two without talking, but we don't have rows. We parent quite similarly. She's so maternal. She's so patient with them, and I learn a lot from her, he told Radio Times. Joe also spoke about how the public perception of him isn't always accurate. He explained, people think I'm Mr. Happy and I am always positive and upbeat but there are also days where I feel flat. He added, I try to be truthful and honest, and show vulnerability, because that's my superpower. What I've realized about childhood trauma is that it can completely paralyze you and destroy your life. Or it can give you energy and direction. I don't look back and feel sorry for myself. The fitness guru has opened up about his poignant childhood as part of a new documentary, produced by Louis Thoreau's production company Mindhouse Productions. In the documentary, which will air on BBC One next week, Joe goes on an emotional journey where he looks back on his turbulent childhood. His mother had acute OCD and his father suffered from heroin addiction. Dot. He also explores how parental mental health affects families today. In March, Joe swapped his fitness gear for a suit and tie as he was awarded an MBE. His YouTube workouts kept the nation active during lockdown as he became a supply PE teacher and raised 580,000 pounds for the NHS.